What's up? What's up? All right, so um, last couple of days have been a little weird. I flew from Boston, or no, I'm sorry. I flew from Denver to Boston the day before yesterday. I got in around midnight. I came to my hotel. I ate some food. I ordered Uber Eats and I ate like a salad and some chicken. Uh, I woke up the next day and I got sick. So all day yesterday, I was just like super sick. I didn't feel good at all. I felt like food poisoning. I get food poisoning, I think like three times a year or something. So that's what it felt like. Yeah, I felt awful all day yesterday, but today I feel fine. Yeah, today I feel I feel normal, I guess. Uh, maybe a little weak or whatever, but yeah, not dying. So, because yesterday I felt like I was dying. I'm good. And my hotel has an entire kitchen in it. This is a refrigerator in my hotel room. So shout out to Elements for the surprise apartment style hotel, because it's actually pretty nice. So yeah, it's not all about fancy, it's just about things. I just like different stuff, and this is different. So Stab is flying in to Boston right now. Hopefully his flight does not get delayed. There's snow in Denver right now, which is ridiculous because it's like 100 degrees in Boston right now. Uh, he has the merch and he has some shoes for me for us to take a look at, which I'm really excited for. As far as the pop-up goes, we do have a place. It's not in Boston technically, it's in Lynn, Massachusetts. My friends over at The Vault are gonna host us. We moved to Lynn because guys at The Vault came through, so there was no problem with us popping up there. So tomorrow, Saturday, at, at The Vault in Lynn, Massachusetts, 12 o'clock noon. That's where the pop-up is for Boston. Boston merch should be here tonight. <laughs> Can't think of anything else that's happening today. So, yeah. All right, so Boston today, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't really feel like going sneaker shopping, honestly. Um, so maybe we'll just kick around town and see what's going on for Sab, get some food, normal stuff. Nothing crazy today, I bet. And then get ready for the pop-up tomorrow. There's two pop-ups in New York. One is at Rise on the 23rd. And then the other one has not been, uh, I haven't announced it yet, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be in Brooklyn and I'll let you know as soon as I know. Forgot, the Doobie pre-order is up. Everyone that has been asking about the Doobie t-shirt pre-order, it's up right now at boost-heaven.com. If you want one, you can go get one. There's four different shirts you can choose from, two black colorways, two white colorways. We will be donating a portion of the proceeds to Bulldog Rescue. Uh, I really appreciate everyone that wanted this shirt. It's not a shirt I ever wanted to have to put out. It's not a shirt I ever even thought about putting out until everybody asked for them. So um, thank you guys, I really appreciate it. I miss my dog like crazy. So having you guys uh, be a support system is really helpful. So I really do appreciate it. But yeah, thank you so much for your help and support and love. And I guess I'm gonna go down to Newberry Street and see what's going on. So I don't know, I don't really know what else to do. I just kinda wanna go do something. So Newberry Street it is. I used to live in Boston a few years ago, uh, North Quincy to be exact, probably like, I don't know, it's been over 10 years now. It was a long time ago. Really young. So, and I got into a lot of trouble out here. So, could have gotten in a lot more trouble. This close. What's this close to? This close to not making it out of here. But, <laughs> another story for another day. Yeah, let's go see what's up with Boston. So I just had a full on meltdown basically. I got out of the Uber and thought that I left my, or once I started walking, my phone wasn't in my pocket. So I thought my phone was in the Uber. So I hailed a cab, tried to call. There was no answer because my phone's always on silent anyway. Get into the cab and like just take me back to the hotel. Get to the two blocks from the hotel, reach into my bag and my phone is in my bag. So now we're back on Newberry Street uh, because I have my shit together finally. This is also probably really windy in the microphone because today is just not going well so far. Yeah. Yep. 
You guys got all the fidget spinners, huh? We do. We got those ones. We got those light up ones, that shaped like, ones. That's crazy. Yep. All right, eleven fifty eight for total. Look at that. Look at that line of salads. Hey, I heard change. Salad I heard, life. I heard change your lives. He wanted Chipotle. I said nah. Don't ever eat Chipotle. No Chipotle. Don't listen to him. I said <laughs> salad first. Nah, you said Chipotle. Okay, maybe I didn't. That was your said. first judgment. <laughs> Yeah, I've made it <laughs> to the homeland. Mm. The goodies, though. Oh yeah, let me change batteries real quick. In the OG cat bag. I'm sorry, I didn't know what Boston stuff to bring. So oh, yeah, see, so brought it all. Brought it all. One off. Yeah, nice. Is that mine? And that's yours. Nice. Woo! 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 Data mosh pack. Uh uh uh. Nice. Just got back to the hotel. Ugh. Ugh, sad guy here. Oh my god, I'm scuffing him already. A data mosh pack. So let's take a look at the data mosh real quick. I already have these on my feet. This is the Gucci colorway, as people were calling it. Super, super sick. NMD R1, all PK. PK upper, PK collar like we love. Back to the OG. This is still my favorite NMD. I like, I think R2s are more comfortable, but I like the way these look the best. Crazy, I guess, data mosh upper pattern super crazy uh, kind of looks like the inside of the camo nmds if you look on the inside part this is what the inside kind of looks like i don't know if they referenced that when they were making the shoe it's definitely a super cool look it's definitely unique these are gonna turn heads everywhere for sure um sns drop these uh, yeah so the sns nmds super sick for me these are 12 and a half so i can go down half size in the pk nmd and they're totally fine. It's honestly perfect. I can also wear a 13, it really doesn't matter. Yeah, so with this one, obviously, white boost, white bricks, silver Adidas branding, uh, multicolored upper. It's not really peppered in on this one. I guess it's a white base with green and red peppered in if it had to be. White laces, white Adidas in the back. No insole, and that is it. You talking to me? No, I'm talking to a camera. Cool. And then the other pair is the uh, ice, I would guess with like an ice blue color. So this one, uh, same thing, everything's the same. White boost, white bricks, white laces, white everything. Uh, this one has a white base with blue and mint green peppered in as well as gray or digitally data moshed in, I would say. It's not peppered at all. But this is the blue, ice blue pair. And again, same thing, uh, size 12 and a half, both of these came. Shout out to the boy, Mayor. I don't know if that's how you say it. I'm really not sure. Got these to me from Paris on the day they released an SNS in Paris, Colorado yesterday, and they just got to me today. So, but this is the SNS Data Mosh pack. It's a must cop. They're definitely super fire. You should get them. Resale is probably gonna stay ridiculous because it only released in one store. Good luck. Good luck.
kids. Killing me here. What, Abby and Heimer fuck up? You don't want to say it? The, yeah, well. <laughs> I'm just waiting for you to show me your shirt. Ooh. This is by far one of my favorite Boost Dodge shirts. Ooh, tomorrow.